The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another video. And guys, what you're seeing on your screen is no, it is not Madden Ultimate Team. This is Madden Mobile. And yes, I am back playing some Madden Mobile today, guys, because they actually did something that I was hoping for Standard Ultimate Team to do, but they never went around and did it, unfortunately. This is something that I really enjoyed in Madden 15. They had a Cornucopia pack, and this is something that Madden Ultimate Team just isn't doing this year, unfortunately, but Madden Mobile saved the day. We have cornucopia packs, guys, in Mad Mobile right now. If you log in, you're going to be able to go over to your store, and you're going to be able to see that, indeed, there are cornucopia packs in the game. Now, the cornucopia packs contain a ton of different things in them. What it says on here is that it contains one blitz ticket, one gold or better base player, or Thanksgiving player, excuse me, and then 14 other team items. Now, unfortunately, it doesn't really go into the real description of what you get, but what I will tell you is that you get a ton of good stuff out of this. I saw Chase do this video earlier. He got a ton of elites out of pretty much every single pack so i'm really excited about it i think we're gonna be able to pull some really good stuff out of this guys so the only day that this is available is today thanksgiving day so happy thanksgiving everybody hopefully you guys are gonna enjoy this video hopefully we're gonna have some fun doing it if you guys do enjoy the mad mobile content let me know we are gonna do the mad mobile content going forward i think on this channel so if you guys are interested in this, be sure to, to click that like button, subscribe if you're new. And uh, with that said, guys, we have enough coins that we should be able to open up five of these things. So I'm, I'm interested in doing it. Let's open them up, man. We got enough coins to do it. So let's go, guys. We've got the Cornucopia pack right there, the very first one. I'm a little bit nervous about it, but I think we're going to be able to pull some cool stuff out of this. So let's go, baby. Let's go. First one, silver trophy. All right. Then we get a DeMarco Murray collectible. This is a flashback collectible from 2011. So a nice card there. And then we get a Brandon Browner. I believe that's a game changer card. Those cards are actually worth a decent amount, or at least they have been in years past. I haven't really played mobile this year mu much, so please forgive me if I pull something epic and don't really realize it. And we get a Julio Jones, baby. Let's go. An 89 Julio Jones. That is a really, really nice pull. Definitely one of the best base elites that you can pull in this game. So that's awesome. We get a Donald Penn as well. A veteran Donald Penn. That is a 90 overall. Oh my gosh. Dude, we're pulling some fire to start this video, baby. Let's go. You guys know my love affair with Don Donald Penn from the back of the Madden 25 days. All right. Then we get a, a Javon Hargrave. Okay. All right. A, ba a base gold player there. A Doriel Green Beckham. Okay. I don't think that that's worth a whole lot. We get a defensive backs card there. A Steve McNair positional collectible. I'm not sure what the collectibles are in this game as far as which ones are the more expensive ones. My guess is that the positional ones aren't that expensive, but I really don't know. But at least it's a Steve McNair, if nothing else. Uh, Derek Wolf, okay. A Ryan Quigley. That is a journeyman card, if I remember correctly. Yep, a journeyman gold card. Uh, Gerald Hodges, okay. Kyle, Kyler Fockrell. That guy's name is... Come on, man. That That's just way too close. Dan Bailey, Thanksgiving card. Okay, so we didn't get an elite there, but at least, you know what, man? Dan Bailey's one of the best kickers of all time, one of my favorite players. And then we get our blitz ticket there. Now, if you guys are unaware about the blitz ticket, this is something that they've done in years past. Um, they're actually used in, uh, or from basically from uh, Black, or what, yeah, Black Friday, so tomorrow until Cyber Monday, at least that's how it's been in the past, um, you were able to redeem the Blitz tickets for other packs and players and things like that. Like, in years past, they had like a Julio Jones, they had a Mean Joe Green, a Night Train Lane that you could get, and then you could put them in for like Pro Packs, All Pro Packs, um, Quick Sells, like all kinds of different cool stuff. So, um, definitely nice to get those Blitz tickets. I don't know, I mean, we're only gonna get five of them from this, so I don't know if we'll actually have enough to really do anything with them, but you never know. You never know. We might open up more packs. You never know. All right. Let's open up our cornucopia pack. Second cornucopia pack of the day. We got some fire out of that first one. Devontae Parker is our first card out of this one. I bet that's actually a pretty decent card. Bet it's pretty decent because Devontae Parker is pretty quick. Yeah, 90 speed. I'm not surprised. That is, that's a pretty nice pull, actually. Um, all things considered. It's a team of the week pull. Then we get our blitz ticket. Uh, Kendall Langford. 
Let's go. We get an AJ Green. Dude, we got a Julio Jones and an AJ Green already. Awesome. AJ Green, unfortunately, is going to be injured for quite a while, it sounds like. Uh, we get a CJ Procise, who's also injured for quite a while. I think his season might be over. Uh, silver trophy there. We get a Blaine Gabbert, all right, for a, a game changer there. And then we get a D'Angelo Williams 2008 flashback. Okay. Linebacker collectible for Ted Hendricks. All right. We get an Anquan Bolden journeyman. That's an elite an elite journeyman, man. I, I don't know what that's going for, but I know that uh, not a lot of those are elites. Dante Moncrief for our Thanksgiving player. And then we get a bronze. We get a Brandon Scherf. Um, a Mario Addison. Okay. That's the Football Outsiders, by the way, that Brandon Scherf. Uh, and then we get Kendall Hunter. And then we get a play. So, not too bad, man. All right. We're getting some cool-ass pulls out of this, dude. We got the freaking AJ Green. We got Julio. We got... I mean, look at this, man. We get... Look at all this red paint in this thing. These things are, if nothing else, even if you don't make your coins back, you know what's what something's different on Mad Mobile, at least in the Cornucopia packs? You're actually pulling cool, cool stuff. Like, uh, that's a rarity. Like, already, the, all this stuff that I've pulled out of these packs are, like, better than anything I've pulled this year in Ultimate Team. So, uh, in standard, like, console Ultimate Team. So, this is an improvement for me, at least. Definitely, as far as excitement goes. All right, guys. Third Cornucopia pack of the day. Let's see if we can get anything going here. We get that Brandon Scherf again. I saw Chase pull that card multiple times. So, that must be, like, the most common one that you can pull, at least as far as elites go. Um, that Blitz ticket again. We can use that later in the week. Kevin Smith, okay. A Nick Foles throwback for a flashback uh, card. So that is a uh, like a collectible. Let's see here. Silver Trophy. Rashard Matthews. He's been actually stepping it up quite a bit here in the last couple weeks. If you're a fantasy player or if you're a Titans fan, he's, he's been performing pretty well. That's our game changer. Um, I believe that's a game changer. Yeah, it is. Game changer goal player. Uh, Robert Ayers, journeyman. So again, we got that elite journeyman last time. Um, we get a seasoned veteran there. Achea Rubin. Doriel Green Beckham again. We get an Earl Thomas Elite. Like, I, I have no words. Another really nice base Elite pull, man. I'm very, very happy about that. Justin Rogers. we still got a couple awesome cards that we get to pull out of this one as well. Another Dante Moncrief. Long pass there. Another De Devontae Parker. Okay. Tim Brown. That's a legend flashback. Or a legend collectible, I should say. And the Sheldon Rankin. So, dude, look at all this fire out of these packs, man. This is crazy. It's crazy how much good stuff you get out of the Cornucopia packs. I'm definitely a fan of that. We got two more of these babies to pull. Wish me some luck, guys. Definitely hoping we can get something good out of these. Whew, I don't know. It's, this is going to be interesting. We get a Jared Cook flashback from the year 2011. Okay. Tyler Patman. Zach Ertz. Come on, baby. We want some fire. Dude, we're looking for that freaking uh, Ezekiel Elliott. I'm wearing my Ezekiel Elliott jersey right now, by the way, guys. Thanksgiving Day, Cowboys. You know how we roll. Trying to get that 10th win this year. Devontae Parker. I pulled a Devontae Parker almost every one of these packs. Matt Stafford there for Thanksgiving Day. It's actually probably a pretty decent card, to be honest with you. Stafford's having himself a nice day today. 90 throw power out of a Matt Stafford. So that's actually pretty good. Crockett Gilmore. Um, not a whole lot of fire out of this one. And right as I say that, we get ourselves a Patrick Peterson. It's a punt returner, Patrick Peterson. So it's not the cornerback. I don't know if the Patrick Peterson cornerback is worth a lot more than the punt returner. Again, I really have no idea. But Patrick Peterson is a freaking beast either way. It's an 87 speed. So probably not the best, but still pretty decent. Jordan Todman, a blitz ticket. And then we get a Randy Moss year collectible. Let's go, baby. Randy Moss, man. That is awesome. We're getting some good stuff out of these packs, guys. Seriously, this is awesome. Definitely having the most fun doing this pack opening that I've done out of any of the pack openings that I've done on Madden Ultimate Team this year. So if you guys enjoy watching these type of pack openings, be sure to hit that subscribe button because I think we're going to do a lot more of uh, Madden Mobile just because this is a lot of fun, man. It really is. I know that they're not always going to have packs like this, but still, it's, it's a lot more fun than on uh, console. So we'll start off with James Bradbury. This is the fifth and final one, by the way, guys. Matt Stafford again. Uh, I think that's the second or third time we've pulled Stafford, our Blitz collectible. We get a Mario Williams flashback collectible. Okay, we get a Navarro Bowman, 85 overall. Unfortunately, his season is over, but still a decent card. All right, Journeyman Taylor Mays. Now, Taylor Mays uh, has been a player in previous Maddens, at least, that they really gave boosted attributes to, despite the fact that he's not a very good player uh, because he had such a, like, a monster combine and things like that. So he does have a 90 acceleration. 82 speed, though, is a little bit low for him, but he's usually got nice hit power. Um, his coverage attributes are always terrible, though. 
All right, two-point conversion play there. So we get a random Thanksgiving collectible. I don't think we've been pulling those, at least not that I've noticed. Dorial Green Beckham, Donnie Jones, that is a punter card. We get a Cameron Jordan, Football Outsiders. At least it's an elite, not the best thing that we could have pulled. Raphael Bush, Silver Trophy. We get a Jace Amaro, a Justin Durant, and then our Steve McNair player collectible. So, guys, that is the pack opening video. We've reached our limit, unfortunately. If you guys want to see more of this, we might do it on another account, possibly. If you guys enjoy this video, please let me know by leaving a comment below, hitting that like button, subscribing, and even possibly retweeting the video if you guys really enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much. Hopefully, we pulled some cool stuff. I'll have to go back and take a look and see what the value on these things are. But uh, let me know in the comment section below if there's anything that's super fire that I pulled or uh, anything like that so thanks again guys hope you enjoyed it be sure to drop a like subscribe if you're new and i'll talk to you guys again soon Bye bye